Hello everyone, how's it going? This is Nintendo Capri Frickin' Sun, and as you can see, I'm making a video! Whoa! Holy cow! Um, yeah, today I got my computer back. And this is Earthbound, by the way. I guess I'll be starting a Let's Play of this now, because it's a long story, let me tell you. Um, well, it's not that long of a story, actually. Basically, my entire hard drive got replaced. They did replace the hard drive, that's what it was. And so I'm pretty sure we're okay now. And so, I don't know, I have to turn that down just a little bit. Um, yeah, so, but because of that, I lost all my save states and everything else. So, I'm gonna actually skip the intro to this. There's actually an intro that shows, like, the characters walking around and stuff, but it's kind of spoilery, so I'm gonna skip it. I don't know. I never know what to pick here. It's all ugly. So, I'll just name this guy Tim, because that's my name. You know how I said before I was going to name all the characters after you guys? Well, I guess we're going to do that. Except for the girl. I don't really know any females on here that closely. I know Shanna, like Sakura, but... Like, it doesn't... It, ugh, you can only do five letters, so it kind of sucks. But I always liked Sky for the girl's name. So, it's like the last several times that I've played, that's what I've picked for her, so. This guy's gonna be Josh, because 900 Red Yoshi, he's in school, and so that kind of makes a sense for him to be that guy. And then this will be Zack, also known as White Mage Serenia. So, oh man, I gotta name my pet. Well, oh, I should have planned this better. I didn't. I forgot about this. I kind of got this idea what I want to name him, but uh, I don't know. Yeah, um, he's never gonna see this anyway. So what the hell? There's some weird sound effects in this game. Favorite homemade food? Well, probably TV dinners, but that's not gonna fit. Um, ham and cheese salad, Coke, that's not a homemade food, please. Well, I know they have, like, preset options that you can go, if you go down to where it says don't care. I might just do that and see what kind of options they have available. Let's just see. Steak, pie, pasta, cake. Yeah, we'll just go with cake, what the hell. I don't know, I just, I don't know what's, I should, you know, normally I'd spend, like, forever on this, just thinking of the perfect thing. Now, the first time I played this game, I put love for this one, L-O-V-E, but I'm not going to do that this time. I'm not going to be that corny. Just pick something and move on. Uh, yeah, I guess judging by my last several videos, this would make sense. I'm pretty sure that's one of the presets options, though, too. Yeah, that'll do it. Let's do it. I kind of sort of don't really... <clears throat> I'd like to get past this intro as quickly as I can, because I haven't played this game in about three years, aside from a partial Let's Play that I watched, where somebody got, like, about three videos into it and then stopped. So... So I kind of want to get past this part, because it's like I've already seen it, you know, because I just saw it, like, a few months ago. This is Onet, of course, your hometown in the game, in case you couldn't figure that out. And this is your house. And inside your house, there's you. And, oh my god. Yeah, this is Tim's house. Tim, who the hell is he? Yeah, I'm, I'm just so glad I got my computer fixed. I'm telling you, I am dying here, man. Uh, I think I've said that before, but uh, I don't even know how to act now to be doing this again. This is just like, what the heck, man? Oh, no. Well, yeah, that'll wake a person up. See what's going on out here. This over here is my sister's room. She doesn't let you name your sister. Hey, bro. Did the sound wake you up? Were you freaked out? Why are you still dressed? Or did you just get dressed that fast? I don't know. Whatever. There's a cracked bat in here. You can actually go and equip this right away. Go from 2 to 6 on the attack, that's pretty decent. 
And if you don't do that, uh, well, you can forget about winning any fights. But we're not going to be doing any fighting in this video. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get to that part. This is my mom, obviously. <laughs> the, the dialogue in this game is completely hilarious. It's like the funniest game I've ever played. It's the funniest game I think any most people would probably agree. It's one of the funniest games out there. Just, there's a little, there's something for everybody. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. I might be getting this confused with a later scene. I thought something else was supposed to happen there. Oh, no. Oh, thank God. Every time I step out of that house, I just know that photographer is about to come out of the sky. It's throughout the game, at certain points, when you walk over certain spots, this photographer will drop out of the sky. And it's like a cutscene that lasts like 30 seconds, and you got to sit there and watch him take your picture and say all this stuff. And it's just like, he's got to be the most annoying character in any video game ever. Anyway kind of talking over the cops here. These cops are kind of funny, too. So it would seem that a meteorite has hit nearby, and we're going to go check it out. Sounds kind of cool. It ties right in the theme implied by the title of the game, Earthbound. Yeah, as soon as I can get back to where I was on Secret of Mana and Zelda, I'll start back on those again. And I'll basically just do all three of these at once. But... I don't know. Uh, I think I might try to just go ahead and get a link to the past out of the way because I know I can. I can get that done in a week if I wanted to. Just based on from where I'm at right now, which I think is pretty far. Well, didn't I get to the dark world? I can't remember. I had one video ready to upload on my old computer before it crashed again. Now this guy actually will be important later in the game, but just pointing that out. Um, yeah, one of the videos I had on the old computer before it crashed, I didn't get a chance to upload it, but at the end of that video, there was a cliffhanger of me dying at the boss. And I didn't mean to die at the boss, but I did, and so I got pissed off and I turned off the video and stopped recording, and after I stopped recording, then I realized, oh, wait a minute, I got a fairy in a bottle. So, so what I had to do was get back to that point with the same number of rupees, the same number of arrows and everything, and then let myself die in that same spot on the screen so I could start recording again as if I had planned it, which actually I hadn't. But you're not going to get to see any of that anyway, so I guess it doesn't matter. Uh, am I supposed to do something here? I think you got to talk to one of these. I guess you just talk to... No, we're not friends. <laughs> what, me friends with that vagina face? No. <laughs> Thanks to uh, Trask Nari for that... <laughs> for that little... Uh, euphemism there, that nickname. I pokey, he says. So pokey is basically like your so-called best friend, but whether or not he's really a friend, I don't know. I guess at some point in everyone's life they have that friend who's not really a friend, it's just somebody who uh, picks on him. I used to have this friend, Chris Long, and like, I would hate going to his house because he would like chase me around with lighters and stuff, and I was just, I was a little scaredy cat is what I was. Here's some presents here over here. You'll find these presents all over the world. There'll be stuff in them, weapons, or healing items. And healing items, they could be just about anything. There's so many different kinds that I don't even know what they all do. You got bread rolls, you got eggs, you got pizza, you got picnic lunches. It's just about any food you can think of, it's probably in this game. It's got bananas. Um, <laughs> okay, here we go. Yeah, your mom will be standing outside of the house. That means that you have progressed the plot, so now we just go back to bed. But later that night, haha, <laughs> yeah, and you thought this night was over? Think again. What in the world is that? What an annoying knock. <laughs> yeah, really. My land, who could be knocking? I say that all the time, I say my land. Have I said that before? This, this game is where I got it from. More of that weird music, boy. <laughs> I 
I mean, I'm telling you, it's just non-stop, I'm telling you, but this game is like, they're always doing something weird, I tell you. Oh, yeah, sure, it wasn't your fault. Yeah. I don't feel like finding out what it does if you say no. It's basically one of those situations where you have to say yeah eventually. Yeah, I got the tracked bat. I'll get the dog later. Remember to go for it! Uh, yeah, yeah, I should change out of my jammies before I leave. Well, that's it, uh, y'all. I'm up to 1035, so I better stop here. So, um, yeah, I guess... Ugh. I'm just gonna go ahead and put this up, and um, I'll figure out what I'm doing with Secret of Mana. I got the ROMs already, so all I need to do is just play them and get up to where I was. Secret of Mana, that's gonna take a long time. Zelda shouldn't take too long. Anyway, so that's it for part one of Earthbound. I will see you guys next time.